Hi, in this video today I'd like to show you how to apply and create a list view filter. So a list view filter in the ServiceNow platform is when you navigate to any list view you will see that there can sometimes be a server side filter applied also known as an ACL which stands for Access Control List. So to do this in the ServiceNow platform navigate over to the navigator bar type in ACL and then click on Access Control. So in order to create a new access control list, you actually have to click on to your user profile, click elevate roles, click on security admin and click OK. And then click on the new button. So in this instance in today's video, I'm going to show you how you can apply a list view filter to the asset management module. So what I'm trying to achieve here is I only want users to be able to see what assets are assigned to them so then they can't see anyone else's assets okay so let's uh, go through this now so when I go to the type this is basically uh, what type of ACL it is in this instance it's a record and the operation so I want to do it from a read only perspective so I only want the user to be able to read what assets are assigned to them and then name so this is the table so I need to type in hardware and select the ALM hardware table Okay, so then this field here is if you want to specify a certain field, but I'm specifying the whole record, so I'm going to leave this empty. So I don't want to select a role, I want this to apply for everyone that accesses the asset management module. So now I'm going to specify a condition. So I'm going to select on assign to. I'm going to select the dynamic filter. I'm going to put me. So what this means is basically if I go to the asset management module, I will only see assets that are assigned to myself, and that applies for any user. So I'm going to hit submit. This is going to create the ACL. Hit continue. So right now I'm going to impersonate a certain user to see if this uh, implementation worked. So I'm going to click on my user account, impersonate user. Let's click on Abel Tutor. So now we're impersonating Abel. So let's go to the hardware assets section. And you can see that Abel can only see the assets that are assigned to him. And you'll see there's a little note here at the bottom of the screen. Number of rows removed from this list by security constraints is 18. So it's basically just telling you that certain records are not visible at this time. Okay. So that's how you create an ACL to create a list view filter. Thank you.